Hello everybody and welcome, you're watching Dave Playing Games. My name is Dave and I am playing Fallout New Vegas. Today I am faced with one of the toughest challenges of my YouTube career, trying to make the Battle of Hoover Dam into a 17 minute episode that's interesting. Hmm. So I've killed the only two people that seem to have a plan around here, destroyed anything that I may have as a decent army, and now I have to take on two of the strongest factions in the entire Mojave to win the Battle of Hoover Dam and secure my future as the King of New Vegas. Simple. So let's get things underway. What does the dam have in store for us? So the NCR appear to be up ahead and they appear to not be hostile. Bonus. Oh, but there is red. What the... What the... Great Khan Warriors. I... I didn't think you guys turned up. Okay, well I'll... I'll leave you guys to it then as you're scrapping with the NCR. No need to get involved myself. My Securitron bodyguard, however, has no such inclinations. He's very much wanting to get involved. Good job, buddy. Whoa, what the... What the hell was that? And, oh look, it seems like the Legion have turned up as well. Jolly good. Securitron, do you think? Lost a minute. I will just repair up this service rifle so it's as good as it can be, and I'll wade in on the action. Good stuff. He seems to have done most of the work, but, oh, there's more coming in. Not even entirely sure I'm hitting him. Right. Okay, that definitely hit. That seems to be all of them for now. Right, let's take this opportunity to quickly loot all of these bodies, as we are going to be stuck here. I may as well get as many good things as I can off of the corpses. This is my only source of new gear. Okay, lovely. We've got some water. We've got some new hunting rifles. Actually, thinking about it, let's quickly just boost this hunting rifle. And the guide says I need to get into the dam proper. I'm not really sure how to do that, so I'm just going to follow on forwards see if there's an obvious entrance. Oh, uh-oh, more people, more people. Oh, there's an NCR sniper on the rooftop and seemingly lots and lots of Legion. Right. No, 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 no. Boom, headshot. This weapon is terrible. This weapon is absolutely shocking. Ooh, okay. So the security on doing his thing. Jolly good. Let's try and give the hunting rifle a try. Or, or you know, you could just kill everyone. So my pit boy appears to be directing me in this direction, a bit further forward. Ah, this is where I need to be. Oh god, I'm under fire. Okay, so we just have to find the control room. Simple, right? I'll take this opportunity to do my usual healing because I feel like I'm gonna need it. Oh, some gecko steak. Oh, lots of Legion corpses. It's like they're trying to tell me something. You shouldn't be here. It's best if you just move along. So clearly can't speech check him. It's okay. I'm a friend. Friend or not, no one is allowed in here. Move along. Hmm. But you're not very receptive, are you? Will it upset you we if I walk to the door? Quietly. Will it upset you if I open the door? No. I mean, I think we know what's going to upset them, don't we? Leroy! Jesus! Help me, security drone buddy! Help me! Well, this is going to do virtually nothing. Oh, -ho! critical strike thrust in the criticals. Uh, oh, are you, are you good? And so, being in the control room, we need to go and plug in the override chip. And this, this is where I need to do it. So, install the chip. This is neat. From this console, I could have routed the dam's power input over to the fort and activated that dormant army of Securitrons. So, go ahead and blow up the dam's generators. And when that's done, head back upside and finish off the Legion and the NCR. Thanks. Also, please stop bringing up the Securitron thing. I'm a bit sensitive about it, alright? Okay, so, just go and blow up the generators. Simplicity itself. Oh, Legionaries. No, wait. Not Legionaries. Those were NCR. I say were, because, well, Securitron. Oh, oh, this is ominous. Why are you everywhere? Securitron! Securitron! Help! Oh, hello. He's got a frag grenade. Now I've got a frag grenade. Did your friend have a frag grenade? No, but all stim packs, nice vodka, whatever. I'll take that. Seriously, that's really creepy. Whoa! 
<laughs> Stimpak time, Stimpak time. Jesus. Right, is there any more? Is there any more? I feel there's more. They're in this room, aren't they? They're in this room. Must be the other side of the wall. I feel like I'm going through Stimpaks and Gecko Steak like it's going out of fashion here. Okay, pushing on. Any more for any more? Nothing in here. And... Nothing there. Oh! Oh look, he's waving. Hi buddy! No, I have a sneaking suspicion he's reaching for a shotgun. Yes, he is. Okay, lovely. He goes down. More 308. Other guy apparently has been dealt with as well. Nice. He had nothing of note. Where the bloody hell am I supposed to be going? All the while I feel that guy is judging me. Aha! Power plant floor zero one. This is obviously the way I need to go. And... Oh! There are more Legion. In fact... No, that's my Securitron. Okay, grenade him up. Oh, he was already dead. So I have one final stick of dynamite. I really hope I don't need it. I am, however, finding plenty of frag grenades, so perhaps it's not all bad. Right, let's quickly get this uh, limb situation sorted, shall we? Some healing on the go. And the guide says just to turn left on the balcony as there's an override switch. Lovely. Activate West Power Plant Control Box. Marvellous. Oh. Oh, wow. Right. Okay, having blown up the dam, let's get out of here quick shot. Oh, God. Let's do some dynamiting. I feel like that helped a bit. Oh, I blew up my own leg. And go over to some frag grenades. Maybe that will help. Buddy, let's play catch. I, I can't tell if you caught it or not. A grenade. Oh, no. I think I killed my security drone, buddy. Service rifle. Let's do this. Oh, there's so many of them still. Screw it, last frag grenade. And then try and finish him off with the service rifle. Why, why did that do nothing? Why did that do nothing? Right, I'm just gonna have to pump hunting rifle shots into you. I've got no AP. Right, now we're gonna have to do a bit of, ha, rebound, regenerate AP, that's good. Why hasn't it regenerated my AP? Oh, it's, it just makes it quicker. Okay, okay, okay. So, jet, that'll give me some action points as well. Take some medics, take some stim packs. Nine millimeter submachine gun, do your thing. Please tell me that's all of them. Please tell me that's all of them. Oh, and unsurprisingly, the NCR don't like me anymore. Right, stim packs. Oh, and I've leveled up. Right, well, as I've leveled up, I'll just pump a load of points into Barter for reasons which will become clear later on. So, again, not taking intense training. I will take retention, so my skill magazines last three times as long. I feel like that's not going to be as useful, but we are where we are. Oh, and I'll secure it from, buddy. Oh, oh no. Oh, you served me well. Right, now I have to somehow get out of here and take on the Legion and the NCR without a murder robot on my side. Oh, and all the drugs are about to start wearing off. Aha! Exit. That is exactly what I want. Stop wearing off, you horrible drugs. Is it through here? Apparently it's through here. Why would it not be through the kitchen? Lovely, that must be a service elevator. Just gonna reload. Out into Hoover Dam proper. So, oh god, more Legion. Right, there's more Legion outside. Oh, hello. However, it does appear to be, yes, more Securitrons. Wonderful. Let's get nice and close and see if I can do some damp. Are you fighting with a chainsaw? I'll ask questions after I've shot your mate in the face. Or not, apparently. Oh, lovely. What a shot. No Dave Dave, the sniper of the century. Oh, hello. Anti-material rifle. Well, I'll be taking that. And further down the dam, there appears to be more shooting, more Securitrons, probably more Legion. Oh, 
lovely. Down they go, but... Oh, there's more. There's more of them, and they are armed with hunting rifles. You're not armed with a hunting rifle. Oh, another anti-material rifle. Yep, yeah, kill him first. Oh, oh, God. It can do that? That's not good. Grenade them, please. Right, well, I'll eat some food, take a bit of medics, try and close the distance. Oh, and get shot! That's not good, that's not good, that's not good. Oh, and the jet's worn off. This is the worst time for all of this to happen. Have another gecko steak. And... Okay, they're nearly dead. It's a shame I can't hit them, though. Can I manually do it? Oh, yes. Oh, it's like shooting legionaries in a dam. And down you go. Somehow I've gained karma from that. Getting mixed messages. Apparently murder is good now. So I search these guys and oh yes, anti-material rifle and some more ammo for it and some 308 and some purified water. Lovely. So if I just combine these two anti-material rifles, then I end up with one anti-material rifle that has a damage of 64. Oh, beautiful stuff. Happy day. So let's just come along here and oh, oh, there's more legionaries. Fortunately, these guys are going down nice and easily to the Securitrons. And I'll just pop a couple of headshots into this one. That seems to be it. That means we've got across Hoover Dam and I didn't die. So here we are. What appears to be very much a Caesar's Legion camp. The guy down there hasn't seemed to have seen me yet. Guard towers. Well, this seems like an excellent time to use that anti-material rifle, as it's a hell of a long rifle with a great scope. Oh, God. I was going to say a great scope on it, but look at that weapon sway. Sunny Smiles says to crouch to see if that makes a difference. No, not even a little bit. Nailed him. Nice pants. Let's keep on creeping. Oh, there's another guy over there. I think I have something for this. Yes, I've been picking up steady. Let's see how well that works. Oh, perfect. It doesn't reduce weapon spread. It completely eliminates sway. So, damn you go. I have discovered Leggett's camp. Right, take some crispy squirrel bits and some purified water. And you know what, bollocks to it. Some sunglasses as well, because if this is how I die, I die looking cool. Well, it seems okay so far. Apparently, nobody else in the camp at the moment. And this is where I need to be. Right, so having fought my way through the camp, which was surprisingly easy, I won't lie, I just ascend these steps up by all the crosses that they've got ready for all of uh, all of the other bennies. Why am I in danger? Why am I in danger? Oh God! Where did you come from? That that should have killed you. Why did that not kill you? That's more like it. And I'm detected, but not in danger. And I should really stop delaying because, well, that's the reason I'm here. That's the guy I need to speak to slash murder slash be killed by. So I'm going to go and speak to him, but I'm not going to speak to him without getting completely drunk and reading a magazine first. So Salesman Weekly, read, pop some Mentats, chug a little bit of whiskey and charm the pants off him. An envoy of Vegas, yet to carry yourself for battle. If so, you cannot truly be of that city of cowards. Aha! Well, Legged Lenai... 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 Aha! Well, Legged Lanius, I think I can maybe convince you otherwise. Maybe you're willing to listen to reason. I see you fight with words, like all beneath the flag of the bear. Let us hope your skill with weapons proves greater. No, 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 I really, really hope my words are better than my weapons, because honestly, if it comes down to that, then I am very much a dead man. So, you could absolutely storm through, take the west, kill everyone, everything like that, but did you learn nothing from the Romans that you're styled after? Holding it? Now that'll be a bitch. I have no need to hold it. Anything the West sends against me shall break against the wall that is the Legion. Big talk. I like it. However, if they just don't attack you, you'll starve to death. You think we would march without a means of resupply? We have the fort, 
we will have the dam. Other communities will fall. And we shall harvest as we move west. We only need move forward. There are many towns, many slaves, ripe for the taking as the tribes from the east were. The settlements west are not self-sufficient tribes. They need the NCR and the caravans. Basically, they're all terribly weak, pathetic little individual villages. And the unity provided by the NCR is what keeps them all good. By taking them on, you will just be getting more and more dependents. You rely too much on the trappings of civilization. The people of the West were once tribes. They will relearn their ways, or... Or? Hmm. Long ago, when taking Denver, I had to face such a challenge. Many died over many years to claim the city as ours. It was the lines of food and water that nearly broke the Legion's strength. The West is a trap. The bear has already been caught in it. And it is dying. Trade helped us survive the Great War, and it will do so again. <laughs> then when I return, Man of the West, we shall see if your belief will withstand the blades of the Legion. But I shall give you the time you need to prepare. Thank you. Thank you very much. I and the West will be waiting. I mean, I won't. I'll probably be up in a tower somewhere getting drunk and playing blackjack. Perhaps it is unfortunate Wolpes was not here to hear your words. Something tells me you would prove more than his match. Until the day when our armies meet again, Courier. I shall wait for you on the battlefield. Very nice. So there we go. He's just walked off. I've, I've beaten the Legion. That's amazing. Something tells me the NCR will probably not be so easy to deal with. Well, there's only one way to find out, and that's to go and deal with them as promptly as possible. I should probably sneak through here just in case all the Legion came back and decided not to follow Lanius. It seems quiet. It seems safe. That's good so far. And why have they closed the gate? Ow. Caesar on the cross. Been a long time since I've seen the kind of work you've laid down today. Speaking of, that crazy light show over the fort? What the fuck was that? Some kind of thumb of God you called down? Amazing. Fucking amazing. Could use a hundred of you. Just scatter you over the east like jacks. Give those plum fucks the what for. Well, you're a charmer, aren't you? Anyway, that's great and all, and I'm really pleased you enjoyed my work. Perhaps I could show you a bit more close up. And, uh, well, <laughs> these, uh, these boys with you? <laughs> Hello there, Smiley. If you just toddle off, I'll make sure they don't vaporize you like they did all the Legion. I would sooner spit on the grave of my dead mother than let some courier walk the wasteland fuck talk to me like that. Who the hell do you think you are? Um, this is not going well. I mean, truly, I don't want any more violence. There's been enough of that today, and I'm really, really scared you're going to shoot me in the face. Look, I know you're riding high right now, but let me tell you, you ain't pissing on me right now. You're pissing on the bear. You've been far enough west, I'm guessing, to know how far that claw stretches. Fuck with the bear and... Okay, okay, fine. So, how about I blow you the hell up? You want me to make tracks out of here? Head back west? Tail between our legs? No. I came for a fight today. And if you're looking to make me budge, you better have a damn good left hook or I'm not going anywhere. Damn. So I can't barter with you then. That's a shame. Okay then, Robo Buddies, do the bits. Figured as much. Come on, you sons of bitches, we're ready. I'm not. <laughs> ah! Okay, I am very much being shot to death. Right. So. Hope for the best. Oh, that's not good. I didn't shoot. You didn't expect I was going to succeed, did you? No, this whole trying to beat the game on one life wearing nothing but silk pyjamas thing was doomed from the outset. Although I do have to say I'd be doing David S.J. Hodgson dirty if I didn't say this is a really, really useful book. It explains all of your options really well and gives you a great idea as to where you can find hidden loot and exciting little locations that you otherwise might have missed that are off the beaten trail. It is absolutely possible to beat Fallout New Vegas by the book, just not procedurally and sequentially and literally like I did. But I also understand that you're not clicking on a video that says epic conclusion just to listen to me rant on about a book. So let's give you the ending that you deserve 
Let's go back into Fallout New Vegas, get some armor, and then take out General Oliver once and for all. Figured as much. Come on, you sons of bitches, we're ready. job wrapping things up and I'm not just saying that because I have to I didn't want to make a big deal about this until after we won but well I found some code snippets in one of Mr. House's data banks that will let me um, reprogram my personality to be a little more assertive basically so that's what I'm going to be doing and it's going to take me a while so it'll seem like I'm offline but don't worry everything will be okay I guess I'll see you around. We accomplished a lot together. It was fun. Take care. And so the courier who had cheated death in the cemetery outside Good Springs cheated death once again, and the Mojave Wasteland was forever changed. The courier, with the aid of Yes Man, drove both the Legion and the NCR from Hoover Dam, securing New Vegas' independence from both factions. With Mr. House out of the picture, the remaining Securitrons on the Strip were hard-pressed to keep order. Anarchy ruled the streets. When the fires died, New Vegas remained, assuming its position as an independent power in the Mojave. Preferring neither the best of the NCR nor the worst of the Legion, the Courier was the man responsible for a truly independent New Vegas. He had removed Mr. House from power over the Strip, and broken the influence of the NCR and Caesar's Legion in the Mojave Wasteland. With little law left in the Wasteland, the Brooms continued to defend themselves against the prospectors and scavengers invading their territory. The Brotherhood used the Battle of Hoover Dam as an opportunity to retake Helios I, and came to control the area between it and Hidden Valley. With no organized opposition, their patrols began monitoring trade along I-15 and 95, seizing any items of technology they deemed inappropriate. The fiends overran Camp McCarran during the Second Battle of Hoover Dam. In the anarchic months that followed, the fiends asserted dominance over Outer Vegas. After the courier ensured New Vegas remained free, the followers found that independent Vegas was even more unstable and violent than before. Old Mormon Fort became excessively burdened by the influx of patients, struggling to provide even the most basic of services. With New Vegas' independence formally declared, Good Springs thrived. More travelers stopped by Good Springs on their way to and from the Strip, and the locals grew prosperous from the traffic. The Kings retained their control of Freeside, and while they continued to favor the needs of locals, they tolerated the citizens of the defeated NCR. Armed with a wide array of improvised explosives and stolen weapons, the Vault 19 Powder Gang tormented the Mojave Wasteland for years. Citizens of the NCR were favorite targets, and they always suffered the worst fates. And so the Courier's Road came to an end, for now. In the new world of the Mojave Wasteland, fighting continued, blood was spilled, and many lived and died just as they had in the old world. Because war... War never changes. <laughs>